Hey guys, Steph here. I am the secret slob and I am in the middle of getting all of my routines, house cleaning and otherwise, back on track and just taking my house from chaos to clean. I am doing this in just little tiny steps every single day. Call them baby steps, call it a refresh, whatever. I'm not just going to jump in though and overwhelm myself. I had a baby just one month ago and so this is all I can tackle right now and that works for me. So if you've been following along, we are on day three. I've been making my bed. I've been shining my sink. I've been working on my hot spot. Yesterday I added loading my laundry, um, getting dressed to shoes, which if you're a stay-at-home mom is not always the easiest thing when pajamas are so tempting. And then folding and putting away the laundry, which is also a bad habit of mine to just pile clean laundry and dig through the pile of clean laundry. Not good. Today I'm adding three more items to the routines. So the first one is emptying the dishwasher first thing in the morning. The middle of the day one is decluttering for 15 minutes. I use this time to either declutter and actually purge things out of my life or just look into a drawer or a cupboard and reorganize it. You know, like the Tupperware drawer has to be tackled at least once a month. So 15 minutes of decluttering, 15 minutes and that's it. You don't have to finish the job. You don't have to pick a small 15 minute job. Just work on it for 15 minutes. I don't have all day to be decluttering or cleaning. So 15 minutes is the time I use. And then the last thing is starting the dishwasher at the end of the night. If you are already feeling overwhelmed, that is totally normal. If you feel like you need to take an extra day to set those habits in place, do that. And it doesn't matter. I'll still be here when you come back and you're ready to carry on. So day three, I will show you what I did. So again, loose top, um, comfortable pants, and I'm doing the messy bun. What do you think? Messy bun? Yay? Nay? I don't know. All right, it's first thing in the morning. Everyone's had breakfast. You can see we have extra new dishes there. And I'm just unloading the dishwasher. This is a chore that I'm going to try and teach my oldest daughter to do. Finishing up, cleaning up after breakfast, and I just give my sink a quick wipe. Next, I start a load of laundry with whatever I can find around the house. Today, it's baby clothes. And then I go to my checklist and check things off, which always feels really good. So for my 15 minute declutter, I've decided I'm going to go through my clothes and get rid of all my maternity stuff. I feel like I can't find normal clothes to wear every day, so I'm just going through, pulling it all out, just cutting the cord and getting rid of them. Then I've got a box of stuff there that didn't fit me while I was pregnant and I'm just putting it back into my drawers. I'm not really doing any purging right now. I'm just swapping the maternity stuff out for normal stuff and we'll go from there another day. So adding starting the dishwasher at night to our habit list and then shining my sink. My dishwasher was broken, so I understand if you don't have a dishwasher, just do all the dishes and leave them out to dry. I do not fold 90% of my laundry. The only stuff I fold is things that will get wrinkly or things that need to be stacked, like towels. All my kids' clothes, I just sort and throw in their drawers. And I promise I will elaborate on this more in another video very soon. All right, back to my hotspot, and you can see stuff has piled there because it's a hotspot. That's what it's there for. I got rid of the stuff from today, and then I'm just working my way up into those very cluttered cupboard areas. Okay, so that was my day. It's the end of the night, and I'm still looking around my house, and it's not clean. There's still stuff everywhere, but, you know, I know I got a load of laundry done. I know my dishes are done, and I'm going to have a clean kitchen to start tomorrow with. And you know, I don't even have this pile anymore. It's slow, but it's happening. Even if your house still looks messy, you know, mine does too. We are gonna get there. So, and, and I don't have to sort through maternity clothes tomorrow to find something to wear. So I did get a lot done and I'm excited for that. It never takes as long as you think it's gonna take. So I hope you got after something today and you're making a little bit of progress with me. I will talk to you tomorrow.